an important conference because we bring together people from so many different areas and backgrounds. We don't, uh, we're not disciplinary based, we're not uh, sort of uh, sector based. We bring, we bring together people from academia, from business, from government, from NGOs. They can be in any, any branch of policy making, any branch of uh, data science. We, uh, we, we we're open to all and we facilitate the, conf uh, the conversation between uh, people who maybe not wouldn't necessarily get to meet each other, to get the different insights from uh, people with different, different roles. So I think it's a, it's a unique forum and I think it's very important to bring these people together. So the Data for Policy community has grown around seven years worth of conferences um, and we've got uh, people from 70 countries that have contributed to our conferences. Um, we, we look to um, engage with those people through provision of resources. So we have, we have um, a website where we uh, curate information for uh, for, for everyone to look at. We have um, social media channels for promoting news and information. We have a YouTube channel which is full of videos that we've compiled from conferences and other meetings that we've held. Um, we also uh, we have a quarterly newsletter that people can sign up to. And uh, very importantly, we have actually a scholarly journal published by Cambridge University Press, where um, we accept uh, quite a spectrum of different types of publication. We realise that people in the data for policy community are not uh, necessarily going to be all interested in publishing highly academic papers. So we also look for papers um, which are more like commentaries, they're shorter, they're not quite so embedded in the academic literature, they're more the sort of thing that a policymaker would be interested in writing. We also have a, um, an article category which is for um, looking at how ideas have been translated into practice. Um, again, this is um, something that would be uh, more of interest for a practitioner to, uh, to contribute. And finally, we have um, a blog where people can write it, uh, less formally, but still um, informed comment um, that can be disseminated uh, to the wider world. Mm -hmm.